Well, we're gonna, we're getting ready to head out in the morning for uh, what are we doing? Fishing, snagging. We're going fishing. We're gonna go snag some reds or sockeyes. Snagging some mosquitoes right now. Yeah, I'm getting <laughs> I'm getting bit bit pretty bad right now, but that's to be expected. The mosquitoes are having dinner before they go to bed. So we're getting ready. We're gonna head down towards uh, Seward. Uh, we're gonna get up. We are going to get up pretty early in the morning for us. And, and for us. <laughs> And head on down to Seward and do some snagging. I think Resurrection River, at that area, so, somewhere around there. Yeah. So we're, we're going to load the truck up tonight and get ready to go. Yay. I'm going to make a, a fish beater too. Yay. <laughs> I'm going to make a fish beater too. <laughs> Those potatoes are coming up. This is cool. Make that look a little bit pretty. Yeah, I'll cool? put some, or I'll put a little piece of leather in there. Ooh, some sinew. Probably leather. One if you want to. Or the per whatever the permanent one is. Yeah, the permanent. No, I mean a permanent veteran. Permanent veteran, sure. You need. Yeah. Nothing to do but to do it. Good morning, family. What are you doing, Mom? What do you want? What are you doing? I am uh, <laughs> not kicking. Well, we're using the eighty pound line. And then we got this treble hook. So we're hoping that we can snag some stuff.
We just got back from a very, very long day. A uh, very early day. We went down to Seward. We went down to the Resurrection River. And we went uh, snag fishing for sockeye salmon. And we got two beautiful fish. Well, we caught one. Well, we caught one. And then our neighbor gave us the other. Very nice. Yeah, our neighbor, uh, they caught three. And they decided to give us one because they already got a bunch from last weekend. So we're going to go ahead and process this. We got, a, I think it was a 21 inch and a 20 inch. Well, they look the same. Yeah, this, this one's a little bit bigger. Yeah, yeah they're not. This one's like, I think this it one's died. a male. No. Tomorrow. So yeah, we got a bunch of Eggs. row here. Eggs. But I don't, I don't think we're going to do anything with yet. Or, All the, right. or the heart. <laughs> um. Oh look, I got a piece off. What is this part? the fish. That's its guts. That's his... Whoa! <laughs> no! That came out easy. Now this is not... Can't really... Woo! Woo! Woo -wee. That is a little smelly. Look what I got, Mommy. Scissors, real quick. I just got the head and then a bunch of the organs. So, let's see here. How do I want to do this? Probably slice it. Dice it. Uh, wait for that, please. Oh, yeah. Whoa! <laughs> yeah, that's a that's a that's hardcore. All right, so we just need to rinse this guy off and out out and off now. Put that in there. Doesn't it feel gross to you? It's just it's just slippery. Fish guts, people guts, they all kind of feel the same. <laughs> all right, well we're gonna try again. We're heading down to Seward. Yes, go right and again. early. Oh, there was a mosquito, I swear, I swear. <laughs> the uh, limit was increased to 12 per person, mm -hmm. so we're going to go try to get 36 fish. Yes, we are. But we're no going to get 36. But nothing's guaranteed, and we're getting eaten by mosquitoes, so we'll see you down there. Yep, mosquitoes don't take a break. <laughs> We could be on Friday. All right, well, we finally got here. Woohoo! Long journey. Yeah, nice little long trip. And a little car sickness. Now it's time to get ready. Right. Yeah, I was going to try to see you fit in this. Oh, I can't love that on video. You ever, <laughs> you ever seen the video where they try to get all that sausage into the, into the skin? That's probably what it looked like. I don't watch those kind of videos, Richard. Yeah. <laughs> Dance. Oompa, 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 that means in marine, marine climate base. So generally a lot of water, a lot of moisture. And today, this is just gorgeous. There's a nice wind, so it's sunny, but like nice and windy. It's clear. Yeah, clear. I need to put on sunblock though, because this is a- uh, Hopefully the fish are biting. Yeah. Or actually, hopefully the, the fish are or there. We're snagging. Because we're snagging them. Yep. Oh, dang it. No highlights. No.
choose your path wisely. Okay. Well, you have chosen poorly. <laughs> You're gonna fill it, but that's okay. We've already crossed this before. And the water's about the same when we initially crossed. Yeah, this boat's good. Yeah, but I'm getting carried away. Sail away, sail away, sail away. Ah, yeah, hold your hat. I know, I put mine on tight. Probably get a headache. Fjord at the river. I don't think yet we can go to the to the Let's go down there ways first. with the uh, thing again. Um, I'll be back. The tide's coming in pretty quick. I'm playing the game of moving our stuff back. And then it's times like these, I wish I hadn't brought so much stuff. But I gotta move it again. Catch your leg. Remember, cannibalism frowned upon. <laughs> Just dropped our car key into the river. Right there. And I've searched on my hands and knees for the past 15 minutes trying to find it. Um, and that really, 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 really sucks. I, I, I'm at loss for words right now. Um, yeah, it really sucks. So, anyways, I'm going to try to find a locksmith that can hopefully open our car and well, make us a new key.
got back late last night from our second run down to Seward. The limit of fish had gone up to 12 each. We went down there hoping for a lot of fish, but it turns out we skunked out. Zero. We got none. <laughs> I almost got, no, wait, hold on a second. Did I almost catch one? You and Liliana. Yeah. Uh, yes. <laughs> Lost it at the uh, shore. Yeah. <laughs> and then Amy. <laughs> Caught us another key for our car. Yes. I dropped the key to the car in the ocean and the mouth of the, where the mouth of the river meets. I immediately heard it go kerplonk and dropped all fours and tried searching for the key. It was a very lost cause. I mean, the tide was going out, but I was, I was really hopeful that, you know, uh, I would find it. Um, we did not. We did not find it. But we got very fortunate. I was able to navigate somehow, some way, because um, I did have the cell phone in our bag, and I was able to find a phone number of a locksmith in Seward, Alaska, which it's really hard to navigate things up here as far as there's no web presence for a lot of businesses. Anyways, I found somebody who was a locksmith, and he came and made me a new key which only cost $160 which is really awesome in the grand scheme of things because I found out he'd just gotten back into town and had been gone over a week and um, he is the only one in Seward, Alaska that has locksmithing capabilities so I would have had to got somebody from Anchorage to come down which would have easily been $400 so $160 seems like a lot but it was a, a great value to what it could have been. <laughs> you know what? I'm really happy that that happened because that made that a very memorable trip. I'm never going to forget that trip ever. Yeah. And it uh, reminds you to put everything on carabiners and lock it up. <laughs> lock it up. Yeah, the, the first time we went, it was on a weekend. It was terribly crowded. There were, you know, tempers flaring. Um, Lots of lots of uh, people pushing each other around. Somebody we went with got their pole broken when somebody stepped on it. The second time we went was during the week, and I tell you what, that was Much a thousand percent. Eyeball. Yeah, that was a thousand percent better. Uh, we we skunked out. It's called fishing, not catching. <laughs> yes. Uh, it, it it sucks. We were hoping to get, you know, I, thirty six. <laughs> it, it's unfortunate. We were hoping to get enough food for uh, several months to be able to. Um, kind of live off of but we didn't catch anything because yep. nothing's guaranteed nothing is guaranteed you're not you're so. not guaranteed anything being on this planet yeah. so uh, so we're, we're looking around to see where else we can go and potentially uh i think we do like dip netting more snagging is just kind of uh, very monotonous and it, it's just kind of a numbers game i think yeah it is it is we're gonna we're gonna try to find somewhere to dip net for uh sockeye salmon while the season's still open and hopefully we can get get our limit <laughs> or one <Yeah>. or one <laughs> we are hoping to uh get a lot more fish when we go dip netting we just have to find a good place for it yeah. a nice safe place because we do have uh we do have a child yes we do yeah, and that child <laughs> likes to help and we yes. love that she likes to help but we have to make sure that it's a safe way to help. Mm -hmm. Yeah, absolutely. So yeah. so yeah, anyway, it was a lot of fun. We got to explore more of Alaska. The drive was beautiful. The day was beautiful. It was an absolutely gorgeous day. Uh, and you know, we hope to we hope to have better luck next time. Yeah. So cool. Anything you want to add in there? I don't think so. Okay. I think that was good. It was a good mm. day. So we really appreciate everybody watching. We appreciate your time. Cool. Have a great day. Yeah.